Oh boy, do I have a winner for you today. This is Worm, Journey to the Center of the Earth by Asmic. Let's hope they die after this, huh? Act 1. Non-Malta. Sounds like a non-alcoholic beverage you'd buy in a 7-Eleven. So, here's your first point of the game. And I say point because there's multiple points, as you're about to see. You drive around and try to hit stuff with a cannon that only fires in three directions and barely hits anything you fucking aim at unless you just fire at it consistently. So, yeah. You drive around and you, you shoot this stuff. That's all you fucking do. This is the bulk. So, you drill it. You drill the hole, and you drive around, and you shoot stuff. I mean, where's the ingenuity? Where's the creativity? No, worm needs not apply to that rule. It needs to apply to the rule to piss you off by not telling you a goddamn fucking thing about what you're supposed to be fucking doing, or anything. So let's go back and try that again, shall we? Because I just remembered something. In the corner of the screen, after fucking loads, in the corner of the screen it says change, right? So I'm like, okay, let me see if I can transform, like, you know, do something. So I start playing around with the controls. Well, I figured it out. Up in A. To fly. Don't tell me. You know, don't give me any kind of fucking indication. Just let me guess. That's what this game is. It's a guessing game. So let's speed this shit up. Shoot the half flower, half vagina creature thingies. There's another one. Picking up crap. I don't know what this stuff is. Shooting these... I, I guess they're worms? The floating eyeballs? I don't, it's so... It's so random and repetitive and uninspired. It's... It's a load of horse shit. And the controls are absolutely, and as Wiswar says, they're fucking crippled. They don't work right. So now we got shaky, 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 shaky. Maybe something interesting is about to happen. Think again. Now we're at the meat of the game. The storyline that makes zero fucking sense. With the slowest text since Dragon Power. Dramatic pause for the camera turn. I mean, is this interesting to you? This bores the piss out of me. Wait, Dan! I've got something on the radar! I'm showing a life form in sector 7231953. I mean, like, come on, what the fuck? Here's a question What kid is gonna know what the fuck they're talking about? And here's my face. This is the best part of the game for me. Push the B, now you gotta talk to people. If you do not talk to people, you cannot attack. You have to talk to these motherfucking shitheads in order to do anything in this game. Why? Just tell me why. Possibility plus ten? I'm sorry, I'm not that good at math. Wanna try to fucking explain to me what's going on here? And who names them? Who names their daughter Moby? Moby. You know what? I got a good one. This game sucks Moby dick, okay? So here we go. Shoot the nucleus. The nucleus is obviously the open part of the eye there. Or whatever the fuck it is. It looks like a ripoff from, uh, Day of the Purple Tentacle. Purple, whatever the fuck the LucasArts game is that I love. So yeah, if you don't move fast enough, it attacks you. So now we get the best part. The little tiny worms trying to rape your ass. And believe me, they will rape your ass, because no matter how many times you shoot at them because of these crippled fucking controls, they don't die. And this scene lasts FOREVER! See, now I just killed him. I wasn't even fucking aiming for him. Explain it to me, please. Somebody tell me. And the whole time, you gotta listen to the same fucking music playing, you gotta do the same bullshit, and you gotta continue to talk to people, because every time you get up to that thing you have to shoot at it, you have to get their possibility factors first. And they say the same goddamn fucking thing over and over and over again. It never changes, same fucking thing, same fucking music, and it looks like a modern art- It looks like a modern artist took a big fat steaming fucking shit all over the background. That's a cave? It look like a cave. It looks like Andy Warhol got bored and pissed all over a canvas. I mean, fuck. What is this? What is possibility? Possibility to kill? Possibility of success? Could you tell me instead of telling me, it's in sector this, it's in sector that. So now we finally kill this fucking thing after ten fucking minutes of this bullshit. And now we have the third rape of the whole fucking thing. More slow ass cutscenes. More slow ass dialogue. No fucking point whatsoever. If anybody knows what the fuck this game is about, please let me know because it's been a good ten years and I don't fucking remember what the manual said. I can't believe there are monsters down here. There must be some meaning to all of the meaning to what? I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. And then you get this shit. 
Why don't you walk a little slower, you fucking cunt? Blue crystal. It's beautiful. What does that have to do with anything? I wonder what is beyond this cave. I wonder what's beyond the slowest text box. Oh, look. More modern art shit in the background. More crappy ass graphics in the foreground. And enemies you can't attack because of what? Say it with me, folks. Crippled fucking controls. Yes. I love that expression. Because it so applies right here. I don't care what anybody fucking says. Now, in the past, I've said this. This game is a piece of shit. It's a three layered cake of ass, bile, and dog turds that no one needs to take a taste of. Unless you like eating feces. Here we go. Gang banged by the dogs. Look at my bullets. They don't even fucking hit. And look at it. She's just like, she's moving like one leg is smaller than the other, it looks like. And there's no detail or anything. And, and nothing is explained. And I, and I don't know why I'm playing this now. I guess I want to know what the fuck's going on. And now I figured it out. You can do a kick. Guess how you do a kick. Guess how you do a kick with these crippled piece of shit motherfucking ass backwards controls. The up button. Now here's more storyline that makes no sense. Who is VZR? Who's the it's a VZR2? The Underworlders. The gate should open. With the key. You know what's funny? There's not one fucking typo. You'd think there would be a typo, but there's no typo. Here we go again. Who's Ziggy? Someone? Anyone from Asmic? Somebody better tell me what the fuck this game is about. You couldn't include a goddamn opening sequence? Just complete mystery? Gotta make me drive a piece of shit that looks like a tank with a drill on it? Then you gotta make me do this boring talk to everybody and shoot something a couple of times, a couple hundred times? Then you gotta make me suffer through this? This crap that looks like that fucking Sega CD game that sucked complete and fucking ass? What was it? Time Gal or some shit? Man, I'd rather play fucking Time Killers while stoned than play this shit. At least there I knew what the fuck I was doing. So I get all the way again. Oh no! There's nothing here! Drop through the floor of what looks like a pit. I swear to god, I could have swore it was a pit. Doesn't it look like a death pit to you? Not in Worm. Worm need not apply to the rules of every other fucking game on the face of the planet. It's got its own agenda going on for it, people. And you will not fuck with that agenda, because you will not survive. So now you gotta fight the flapping ninja green dudes of whatever the fuck they are. I mean, I, I never seen somebody who fight you by jumping off your head consistently. And then, and then there's the brilliance of, like, just not being able to hit shit, and then not being able to hit you because of these controls that are just suck ass, hit detection that doesn't work, and a kick that is attached to the fucking up button on the controller? The up button! Not B, not A. Up! Shit, why don't they just use the select button and really piss me off? So my travels are coming to an end here because I was so fucking fed up at this point. And I mean, like, it just was not explaining anything to me. And it's just not fun, okay? It's not fun, it sucks. I wouldn't be reviewing it if it didn't suck. The only good part of this game is coming up. Aside from the music, there's only one line in this game I like. This one. You will not leave this place alive. Who the main time interfere? Excuses! I'll send you to the lab! The lab? Sorry, Moby. You'll never get to find out about the lab, because you're fucking dead! Worm Journey to the Center of the Earth fucking sucks.